Hi, I'm Daniel Liang. In this video, I will introduce the resource to help you design, code, and debug programming projects in the Python level. The starting point for the resource is the frequently asked question page. Let's look at uh, chapter two, programming project two. This is the URL to the page. This URL is printed at the end of every program project. Now I'm going to copy and paste it here. And now you see this is the page. In the first box, and this is the link to the hints page. I'm going to click this link. And so now those are the hints to programming quizzes and to programming projects. So let's look at the hints for end of chapter programming projects. Let's look at uh, chapter two, programming project two. So those are the hints. And the hints gives you step-by-step -step guide and to help you to write the code to solve the problem. After you finish your code and you're gonna to submit to Rebel. <clears throat> and this code is incorrect. So I'm gonna click the submit button. And this is what you see is this logic errors. It doesn't tell you and how to fix it and does not give you any, um, any, any hints. So what do you do? So now we go back to the uh, uh, <clears throat> to the page and for the uh, frequently asked questions. All right, in this page, and this is the question right here. What can I do? All right, so you can use the check exercise tool to diagnose the code. And in the check exercise tool, we have all the exercises. And now you have the uh, programming uh, project two, in chapter two. And so how do you map the exercise to the programming project and right here and click here this is click here so i'm going to click here and you see this is the mapping for the rebel programming project and now this is uh, a chapter two programming project two so i'm going to click on this this is uh, corresponds to exercise uh, uh, zero two underscore zero seven. Click on this, it takes you directly to the check exercise two. So this is the uh, exercise uh, 02 underscore 07. Now I'm going to copy and paste code here. And, and this is the incorrect code. And I'm going to click the check exercise. Uh, this is the button, it's automatic check. It Use this input to test your program. Your program output is this, and uh, the correct output should be this. So this gives you some idea, and you get something wrong here in the um, uh, number of days and the, uh, the years. And you can back and go back to your code and see what the problems are and to find it. Oh, so now here is I found the problem, and now I'm going to click the automatic check. It says this program is correct. Now, if the same program is incorrect in Rebel, please email me and I will take a look. Thank you for listening.